Hi, this is uh, Starting Monday by Shami and Nori. Thank you. Uh, so we did our first video last week, um, which was amusing, and we said we would go away and get some of our techie stuff sorted out yeah. to hopefully make our video a little bit better. Um, and mm, I've made a start, but it didn't go that well. But we're, we're positively we're doing okay. well. There's just a few challenges, mainly me, um, but we're working on that. Um, I suppose, actually, before we go any further, we ought to just point out that we're not personal trainers. Yes. don't have any qualifications at all. No. And we're not nutritionists or no. dietitians. Uh, but we have done lots of training and exercise over quite a long period of time. And we eat a lot. Do you cook a lot? We oh, cook yes. a lot. And, uh, you know, we're just mindful of what we're eating and uh, we've got some lovely recipes and things. But we can share those with you at, at another time. So for today, we thought we would talk to you about how we got started, why we got started, how did we find our goal, um, what was our light bulb moment, because I think everyone has to I have one of those of to drive you through the first, you know, the first, the really hard bit when it's really difficult to get started. So Shami, you tell me about how, how you got started on your, um, your fitness well, like, like Noreen said, we've, we've been fit, so we've, we've got loads of experience, personal experience, of how we've tackled our demons. That's how I see my demons. And I had got, I've succumbed to, life has got to a stage where I had my children, they were growing up, teenagers, working, work was quiet, it was, it was everything was full on. And I had not prioritised myself the way I had when I was in my 30s. So I'd gone slightly downhill. I'd go to the gym, but I wasn't as active. I, so, so Jeremy, you, you were always in there. I, no, no. I, 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 I succumbed to the spin room. Yeah. I just, I don't know why it happened. You were hiding in there, you didn't want to come out. And it was you Noreen. Did. Noreen was my light bulb moment because I saw her in the gym and I'd seen her for years. And we were both very fit, but she was she was there, and I had gone. I had gone from sixty four kilos to seventy. I know it creeps on, it creeps on. Oh, uh, like, yeah, I think that's that's the bit, isn't it? You yeah. know, and so you were going into the gym, from what I could see. Yes. But you weren't very happy about not making any progress. Yes. You see me walking in because I was losing a pound here, five pound there, and doing yeah. whatever. And I suppose. And I, I I could see it. I could yeah. visually see it, and I. And every time I'd see her, I'd say, come in, come in, come in, this way now. And, and then I was like, get out of here, come and do what I'm doing. So, so that, was, that was great for you. Yeah. Um, we, for, for me, I think I uh, had reached the stage where I was buying not the right size dresses. I was buying, uh, having to buy like 16, 18 size clothes. I was really unhappy about mm -hmm. that. Because um, I'm quite vain, I suppose. But more importantly, I realised that my lifestyle was affecting my mental well-being. So, like, I was very anxious. And people that know me um, will know what a really hard time I have with that. But uh, I think what I was doing in my life was contributory to that. And that I think now I realise. I think also um, I've gone to the doctors and my blood pressure was through the roof. That was definitely an indicator for me, although. I tried to pretend it was okay, yeah. but it really, it really wasn't, and people around me were quite concerned. So I think then my life, my goal then was just to be healthier for the future. Yeah, it's just healthier. Um, I didn't want to get diabetes, yeah. blood pressure, because both my parents, my father actually, your mum was my mum. She suffers with diabetes, <laughs> blood pressure. My dad died young; he was only 64. Bless yeah. him. And, and, and likewise, and my mum died too soon, and I think that was also another big wake-up call yeah. for me to get back on the right trajectory, one that was going to be good. And I think, well, look, you, we all know, we've been on diets, yeah. we've done the whole thing. I was fa I'm really fantastic at going on a diet, I can be really motivated, I can be really focused. I'm also exceptionally good at putting it all back on again yeah. with a load more, and that was definitely with a extra, trend. With extra. So, so <laughs> at this point, the next diet I go on, I'm probably going to end up going to need to size 20. So I'm getting bigger every time I come come off my diet because you're um, aging as well. So the, yeah. system, 
the whole system is slowing down. And then you've got menopause. To oh, go with. So that's a whole other thing. So that's another, that's another video tape. So that's, I think that's how we um, got our, our light bulb moment and our drive to do something about it and to change. And I think we can probably, I can safely say now that I'm in a zone where I've had probably four, four and a half, four years, four and a half years of solid maintenance because it's not about being on a diet anymore, it's exactly. about a lifestyle change. Um, in and a positive direction. Yeah, and we're, I think we're both really excited yeah. about that, and w- but we know how hard it is to arrive where we are. So we're, we're, we're kind of yeah. help. Um, so we would love to hear from you. Please. Um, you can either email us at, I've got to get this right, Sammy, at startingmonday919 at gmail.com. Or you can just message us, um, give us a thumbs up on Facebook, and let us know how you think we're doing. Yes, um, please. Anything else you want us to cover? But we're going to have loads of stuff coming your way in the coming weeks. Just to explain before we go, we're actually filming this on Friday, which as you can see is yes, beautiful right. today. And we know what British weather's like. Yeah, it's and unpredictable. It's exactly. It is, it is, yeah, so, but Monday it might be snowing. So if it is, this will explain. Um, why the weather is different. I'm actually going on holiday. Um, so we will, I won't be here. So we're going to upload this on Monday for you. Hope you enjoy it. Um, as I say, any feedback would be great. Um, thank you so yeah. much for tuning in. And we want you to join us on this journey. Yeah, yeah. Please. Please. Oh, everyone says that word, Charlie. But yeah, <laughs> it is. It's okay. We'll go on the journey. Okay, I'm off on my journey to Spain. Uh, we'll see you next week. Take care. Bye. Bye. Bye.